Yeah, man, I got the connect, man. I got trues on my bum. You know how that takey song goes? No, 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 that's not takey, actually. That's why be in the mirror. I got trues on my bum. Oh, shit, I forgot I was recording. <laughs> Welcome to the show. Today, I'm going to be representing the trilogy people. And also, most importantly, representing the hype beast community, including myself. Trust me, I'm a cute hype beast myself. That's why I'm wearing this shirt. The last time, I did show you what's in my Supreme bag, what I usually carry. And that specific bag right there where that bastard is. That guy's gonna die one day, and I'm gonna be very happy when he does. You hear that, punk? Please, don't hurt me, I have two kids and a wife. Now I'm gonna be showing you what's in my Supreme shoulder bag, AKA the man purse. <laughs> this is the future of the human race. Us men wearing bags. <laughs> Nothing wrong with that, we're in 2020. Let me lubricate for this one episode. And what I am using is the coconut oil from my local grocery store, Grocery Outlet. That's the stuff right there. It feels good. That's the stuff. Now that I'm fully lubricated, let's go with the show. Before we move on, please make sure to watch the whole video. Don't miss out on this amazing piece of advice to carry everyone that's into business or in college or in school or is just trying to evolve in life should pay attention and carry what's in this side this bag. Let's go to the show. When I usually carry this bag, I usually carry one other thing. And no, that thing isn't, you know, capable enough to fit in this bag because it's huge. My penny board. I feel like <coughs> having a penny board with a shoulder bag is really, really dope. I don't know, I just always, you know, like, dig the style. Like a skater type of high piece vibe. I dig it. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! Like this, this represents my cleanliness, meaning I like to carry the things that are necessary in my day-to-day -day life. And this is just for transportation. Fun transportation. There's some white stuff on me still. <laughs> Nothing wrong with having white stuff in your face, you know, a couple of times in your life. That can mean a lot of things, and that's for you to decide on what I'm talking about. Now with the bag. Oh! <laughs> I accidentally hit myself right now, and that's okay. In the front pocket, obviously, I believe we should carry the iPhone <coughs> or anything in particular that's really, really important like that. I don't like to try to stuff my pockets with unnecessary things because then it becomes really, really, you know, annoying when it comes to riding a skateboard or just, you know, trying to get into a car, trying to sit down. So it's really helpful to carry one of these small bags, especially on a road trip or hiking. A couple of bars wouldn't hurt anyone as well if you're going hiking or anything, somewhere like that. Or if you're like myself, you know, getting into veganism, having a couple of snacks in it, well, you know, that wouldn't hurt. You think being a vegan is correct? Comment down below because I, that's my journey now. Now let's move on to the front or the main compartment of this. So <laughs> one thing you should carry at all times is some sunglasses. And why is that? Because you want to be, you know, able to protect your eyes and from the sun, obviously. Bruh. If you have prescription glasses, go for it. One other thing that's really cool that I figured out, if you have glasses prescribed to you, you can have sunglasses that are actually prescription glasses. And that, in my opinion, is pretty cool. Boom. These are my reading glasses. Reading glasses. If you know what I mean. How do I look? Like a million bucks or what? Or what? Got it! This is Fendi, and I did thrift this case, and it's really dope. Obviously, Fendi is like a huge brand. It's up to with Gucci, Louis Vuitton. But in all and for all, I think Fendi is better than all of, both of them combined. Another thing I carry, and this is really a must for college students, especially if you're trying to stay awake, natural caffeine. I get money, I dance when I, you know, my girl. I all dance. It's the hassle of, you know, waiting an hour, drinking coffee, making you feel full, burning your lips. Nobody wants that, but what they do want is that quick energy burst. There you go. This really, really helps me a lot, especially when I edit or try to read or, you know, just work on business and thrift. Sometimes when you're feeling down or tired, follow one of these pills, you're good to go. You'll start feeling more energetic and also speeds up your metabolism, especially good for weight loss. I bought this in my local vitamin shop. It was really, it was... I believe so, it was like seven bucks. And you should at least take only one every six hours. <clears throat> and even more than, I believe, 400 milligrams per day. Fun fact, caffeine is a legal drug. 
Another thing I really like to carry is my charger. In this day and age, it's a must to carry a charger because we live off social media. We live off using our phone as the main source for every information, to make money, everything. The power of having a computer right in your hand without carrying a huge laptop is amazing nowadays. You gotta carry a charger at all times just to have the power of a god. I don't know if you guys are into boxing, but you know, I'm, I, I'm a boxer myself. Some mouth guards. And why do I carry some mouth guards? Because you never know when you're gonna get into that situation, when you're gonna be fighting. Obviously, I'm a person that believes in peace. I don't like fighting, but you know, sometimes it's necessary to protect yourself. I haven't, on these one, these I believe I purchased at a Walmart for you know 99 cents. It, it's, you know, it doesn't hurt anyone. I'd rather get punched with these then, you know, punch with, you know, nothing at all. I don't want to have a broken jaw. Really good for running and sleeping. It's going to help you avoid your teeth grinding at night. Some people get it, but if you don't, learn to breathe with your nose in and out. This is honestly the best thing anyone should carry that loves books like myself. If you can see, I have a huge collection of books. I really love books so much. So much, so much. A Kindle. Believe it or not, I did thrift this Kindle recently. I really love reading so much, and this is just on the go. The only reason I love the Kindle more than the book, a book itself. For example, I can carry Think and Grow Rich, my Supreme bag. The, the problem is sometimes I don't have a pen, I don't have a paper, or sometimes I want to read in the dark. Oh, yeah, who wants to read in the dark, right? Problem with that, the Kindle, you can, by itself, you can already highlight, you can take notes, you can also look up specific words. I really love the Kindle. As I was doing research, aren't really that expensive, like 50 bucks, and I feel like this is one of the best things I have. Carry a book. For my opinion, I love books. Like I said, I love books. Think and Grow Rich is a really great example. Give it a try, anyone. And just like I said, just in case you want to sign something or read and you know highlight books. And a bonus tip for when I like to carry my Supreme bag is I like I don't like to carry a lot of things, so I like to try to keep it as organized as possible. <coughs> Even keeping the si simplest things organized can help <coughs> you in the real world because then you start organizing your car, your house, your room, your phone. Keep it organized. Thanks for watching. Make sure to leave a like, a share, subscribe. Follow me on my Instagram down below. Comment down below. Are these the essentials you would carry, or are these just you know like a nerdy type, of, you know hype beast, skateboarder? Cruiser type of person that I am. Thank you guys for watching. Peace. Man, you have a diary. Oh. We're in 2020 now. You know, I'm not really into that. You know, bullying tactics or whatever. I don't really care what people say about me. I'm at the point.